Go fuck yourself. That's why I want to say to the Emperor. In Grimmy et Art Kerze. Dyfen Aden in Karn eb Marvut. Emir var Emreis. Bow. Your Imperial Majesty. Arer ep do orde. Avelian nomin, vat gern favort. What do you fucking want? I thought you bowed before no man. Didn't want to disappoint the Chamberlain. We're friends. Take it you didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days, so... Silence. My daughter, Cyrilla. She's returned. And she's in danger. The wild hunt pursues her. Wow, she looks like a straight up bitch. You will find her and bring her to me. Are you sure? Siri left, went far, far away. Do you believe I drag you here in the middle of a war to discuss a rumor? I think anyone can be wrong, even an emperor. I had forgotten how insolent you can be. Jack I haven't the time to convince you, nor the desire, in fact. Yennefer will do that after the audience. How many men in your army? 20,000? 30? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. She trusts me, yes. So tell me why you're looking for her. Doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. For reasons of state, as always. Enough of this banter. You will agree regardless. If for no other reason than because I shall pay you. More than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more. You know what? I'm only doing it for her. Yeah, she looks miserable in that picture. Save your generosity for those whose homes your armies have raised. I'll do it for Siri, not for your gold. Your motives do not interest me. Only results. Yennefer will tell you the rest. This audience is finished. Meredith! Take him to the sorceress. Do we have to do this? It seems long and stupid. Follow me, if the gentleman pleases. Please keep close. There are many honorable guests in the palace whom the gentleman... Disgusts. ...need not bother. You're all assholes. What? Do you know who you're talking to, soldier? I'm Herevard the second, Prince of Elena. Not only am I there to wait here like a name. Rad Sleden eh Yes, I can understand what you're saying, bitches. So, I, I didn't know, so I don't know too much of books, so I didn't know Siri was the, um, the daughter. Once the gentleman is done, he should see me to retrieve his possessions. Okay. That quill sharpened yet. Yes? Then transcribe. The true authority in Novigrad is not the city council or the merchants' guild. I hope the Temerians fuck guild. you up one of these days. Hey, Yennefer. Geralt, that tunic, you look positively smashing. I hate it. Ugh, dying to take it off. I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. One I might even take you up on. 
but we've matters to attend to. Now do you understand why I'm at Amir's court? Mm-hmm. And it seems we're in the same boat now. Siri, she's really back? No chance he's mistaken? Look, that's more or less what she looks like now. Or so our agents claim. Our little witch has grown into a young lady. How about that? She's grown up. It's been years since you trained together at Kaer Morn. A great deal has changed. What? Better tell me. You haven't. Not a bit. I missed those awkward compliments of yours. But let's focus on Siri, all right? Right. Amir said the wild hunts after her. I'd find that hard to believe before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Because of me. You see, I've spent months searching for Siri, using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the wild hunt might sense it, perhaps even find me, but I thought I'd trick them. Well, guess you were wrong. Mm -hmm. mm. I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. Great. You must find her, Geralt. Before the wild hunt does. The wild hunt? What could it want from Ciri? I've no clue, Geralt. Might have written them to ask, but I don't have their address. I know as much as you do. It must be about her blood. Her gift. As for what the hunt wishes to do with that gift, I... I prefer not to think about it, really. So where's Siri been seen, exactly? In two places. Velen and Novigrad. The trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Ask for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's agents. He should get in touch with you. That's it? No passwords? Secret handshakes? None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the crafts of the trade. All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors. But there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. Great. Oh wait. Oh no. Triss Merigold. Apparently she's got a cozy flat on the main square. Goody. Sure she'll be delighted to see me. What about you? What will you do? I shall sail for Skellige. There was a magic explosion there recently. Blew half a forest down. I believe this had something to do with Ciri. I'll be in care trolled. Join me there once you've learned something. Why didn't you contact me earlier? I mean, I'm a really good tracker. <laughs> One thing before we go. Why didn't you contact me? Didn't need me? Didn't even want to see me? I didn't want to spoil things. I'd heard you and Triss made a great couple. Yen, I'd lost my memory. Really? That's your excuse? Let's drop it, all right? It's not what you think, or it helped me understand how much I love you. I don't wish to hear it. Any of it. Fine. Fine! Fucking amnesia and didn't know Guess shit. Guess this means we need to split up again. Not my preference, but I understand. Clock's ticking. It is indeed. So why don't I teleport you to Velen, get you there at once? Not gonna happen. I'll go on horseback, as soon as I can get changed. Have it your way? Oh, and... You really look quite dashing in black velvet. Think so? Maybe I can have some of my armor lined with it. <laughs> Good luck, Yen. Same to you. And if you wish to learn what's happened in the world while you and Bessemer roam the wilderness, talk to Ambassador Vartra. That's him over there. And Geralt, I know it's wartime, but try not to be a hero, all right? Just check those leads and come back to me in one piece. I shall be waiting. Ah, 
Where? Who is this guy? Who am I talking? To? Nah, I'm gonna trust him. Fucking magic! All right. Where is this ambassador? Ready me. Directly out of Norway. Ambassador Varatra. Yennefer suggested I ask you about current events, the war, and so on. Of course. The Emperor's servants should keep no secrets from each other. If you will, let us approach the map. Yeah, what's been going on? Uh, so, how's the war going? How's the war going? I mean, apart from the fact that Nilfgaard's triumph is imminent. I assume this to be a private conversation. We've no witnesses, so let's dispense with the propaganda, even that shrouded in irony. All right, Our cool. offensive was going splendidly until winter came. Edern was in such disarray that we encountered no resistance. We had reached the Pontar before the first snows. Only a weakened Kedwin remained, and Radovid's Redania, which had ignored the rest of the North's pleas for help. We thought they'd sue for peace, perhaps even submit to vassalization. We waited for spring, Certain of victory. Radovid? Submit? Yes, a vain hope, I agree. Radovid sent no peace envoy, nor did he advance on our positions. Instead, he trudged over the snow bound Kestrel Mountains and attacked Kedwin, his ally. Why? This attack took the Kedweni by surprise. They were still mourning the loss of their king. Rudderless and dejected, they laid down their arms after a few lost skirmishes and joined Radovid. Oh. And so by spring, instead of two weak enemies, we had only one powerful one. What about Kavir? Kavir values its neutrality. Enough not to lend its armies, or more importantly, even its coin to either side. Returning to the war, this spring, there was a massive battle in the marshes of Velen. Massive, yet indecisive. Both sides suffered enormous losses. Unprecedented, even. Radovid has retreated across the Pontar. He's safe for now. Until reinforcements arrive from the south. Then, Emperor Amir Var Emrys will deal with him once and for all. Couldn't you just go home? Save everyone a lot of marching? Not to mention a few human lives. I'm afraid the stakes are too high to fold now. We can only go all in. Yeah, what's the situation in Velen? Hmm. How do things look in Velen? As bad as ever. Perhaps worse. This land never flowed with milk and honey, and now it flows with blood. Armies have swept through it several times. Trampling fields, looting granaries, burning villages. Famine grips the populace. Mm -hmm. So how's ruling that earthly paradise going for you? Not well, to be honest. Our forces are spread thin as it is, and Velen is chiefly swampy forests that are difficult to control. We've had several patrols never return to their camps. Thus, we've temporarily delegated authority in this region to a certain Nordling a former low-ranking officer in the Temerian army, one Philip Strenger, better known by his nom de guerre, the Bloody Baron. I advise you well. Avoid him. Probably not gonna happen. Um, alright. Uh, what's new in Novigrad? Any news from Novigrad? Is the free city still free? Yes. Although everyone knows this won't last. Radovid is in Oxenford, and the Emperor is here, in Vizima, at Novigrad's doorstep, both. And both require coin and ships, and Novigrad can provide these. Which is why the mood in the city is... rather... well, on edge. Meaning? How do men deal with fear? They seek reassurance. And scapegoats. The Church of the Eternal Fire understands this perfectly, and so it promises to improve the lives of its flock by pointing out the guilty. Who started the war? Who profits from it? Why, it's obvious. Mages, elves, dwarves, in a word, 
any and all deviants. I've been stationed in Novigrad for 13 years. First as a consul, then as ambassador. I've seen a great deal. Cruelty, cynicism, greed. But what is happening there now concerns me greatly. And Skelligrad? What's new in Skellige? Nothing. The islanders pride themselves on that, don't they? Doing everything according to tradition, as their forefathers did. And like their forefathers, they quarrel with each other. Pillage. Occasionally attack our transports. This is cumbersome, but nothing more. Skelliger has always been a footnote to history, and so it shall remain. Sound awfully confident. What if King Bran manages to unite the Jarls? Lead all the clans against your fleet? King Bran is a feeble old man. From what I know, he barely remembers the names of his own vassals. Uniting all might prove difficult. Oh, thanks for your help. Thanks for your help. Think nothing of it. May the great sun light your path. Well, I guess that's what's going uh. on. All right, let's get my my shit and go. How might I serve the gentleman? By returning my things. Citrus and cloves. The fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. Mm. Thanks, bunches. Whoa, I don't need to smell the like Emperor perfume. Is not known for his patience. He wants his daughter back safe and sound, as soon as possible. Yeah, mention something of the sort. So long. Alright, so... Is there any rare herbs I can take in this garden? Ooh, quest. Going to take herbs now. All the herbs. We cross the yard, we will cross the pot as well. Du, 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 du. All your plants are mine. Give me all your plants. Plants, plants. Alright. Don't give a shit about you. Guess works. Alright, and who the fuck are you? Mm -hmm. Gwent! Gwent! Sure, five! Wouldn't mind a few rounds of cards. Uh... Can I exchange leaders? Uh... Pick an impound for five to play instantly to clear any weather effects. Yeah! Yeah, I, I like that. Let's start the game. Oh, start the game. Oh, draw a card from your to win whenever you win a round. Okay, now start the game. Choose two draws to redraw. I don't need two rain cards.
Well, you're a dick. What? Fuck! Alright, so... It's... Um... Sets... Close combat. Ooh, wah! Okay. Uh, wow. That's kind of bullshit. Um, I can't. He has only, only have five cards left, right? So I'm gonna just gonna. How do I pass? So play on my cards. Are you fucking me? What the fuck? Mm -hmm. I got nothing. I got nothing. I give up. I give up. Nope. We forfeit. Can we play again? Wouldn't mind a few rounds of cards. All right. Um Change leaders. Still like this one. Oh, these are all my cards. Okay. Uh, do we do we have? I guess I can't. Wow. 
Why would I... Why don't I just put all the powerful cards in my deck? Five, so... Yeah, I, I don't want that. I want this. Uh, these are my sieges. Hero cards, weather cards, special cards. What does this do? Swap a card and let's turn to your hand. That might be useful. have the most of um, I have I have more siege than anything right so I should switch it out with in with maybe I need more swords maybe I don't need as many no I'll take the uh, decoy all right let's start the game that's good No, nah, this looks like a great hand. Um, I mean, I like this hand. All right, fine. Doubles the strength for all unit cards in that row, limited one per row. So it's doubled. Okay. Um, next card, card with the same name is doubled. I should be looking for blue stripe commandos then. What's this do? So it's just red to right, everything will be right, right? Choose one card to discard fire. Oh, okay. So I'll use this in the later game, probably the last game. This. Same. So. No, I wasn't... Okay, sure. Um... with these cards. What does that do for me? Places your opponent's battlefield counts towards your opponent's trying to draw to your... Oh. That's interesting. on your opponent's fan for you draw two cards fine give me those two cards that was a bad move I don't know what I'm doing
What? I quit. I quit. This guy has way too many good cards. I'll be back one day. Mark my words. Mark my words. Can I get my shit back? Am I wearing my stuff? All right. Let's see. Cavalry boots. Uh, actually, it was this one, right? Yeah. And I was wearing medium, light. I look like a mishmash of bullshit. Uh, saddlebag. Oh, my bomb's back. Roach. Um, from humans and non humans, this one gives me 10% chance to. No, that's fine. I'm good with that. Um, got the saddle. Got my food. Got my bombs. Uh, don't need my oils. Got my alchemy. Can I make anything? That is make two oils. Nope, I'm good. Good for now. Good for now. All right. Switch to continent view. Oh my goodness. To open the map. Right cursor. So that's at right orchard and Skell Islands. Oh, it gives you uh level oh thirty five, ten, sixteen. Yeah, we're we're going there first. Hangman's tree. That sounds pleasant. 